I've just arrived at Clifton Downs now. I'm parked up on Parry Lane. So you can see the caravans behind me. I thought there'd be more than this here. You can see the caravans behind me parked up and camper vans behind me there. So that's where a lot of caravans are parked up at Clifton Downs. And also, that's where we've parked just on this road with the camper vans. Columbus is up there in front of the yellow seven tonner horse box. Let's go and have a look round, eh? Come on. Let's see what we can find and see what we can see. And I've just come for a little look about. It's been on the news and everything. I've seen other videos other vlogs so I've come myself while I'm down here just to have a look and see what it's all about so I'm just going to take a little walk around Caravan City so let's have a walk yeah I'm just looking for where all the camper vans are parked up I've seen the caravans but I've not seen a lot of camper vans parked up. So me and Franny and the dog Fury, we're going to have a walk round to see what we can see. But at least we're here. Yeah, well, we're here. And you've got to come to find out the truth to see what it's all about. We're just parked on Parry Lane. A YouTuber, I asked him and he told me to go to Parry Lane. Good park. Good little park up right, but I thought there were going to be more than this here. So we're going to have a little wander about. Clifton Downs in Bristol. Nice houses on the edge of uh, Parry Lane here. Look at the size of the houses. Big houses. That one's derelict what I just walked past. We're going to head further round and we'll have a walk on the other side where we're parked up. More big houses on the edge of the uh, Clifton Downs where we're all parked up. Oh, Destination Unknown Van Life YouTube. There's some more camper vans parked up here, as you can see. An old Merc, a good bus is them. And we're just having a walk down here now, see what we can see. Two more, three more campers there parked up. Yeah, I thought there were going to be more than this here, but yeah. We're going to cut across and go down Caravan City now. And this is the start of it. Do not enter pit bulls, it says. There you go. Do not enter pit bulls.
It's empty the caravan. So I said I was going to be coming here, and I have done. I'm just parked off the main road at the bottom of here. I'm going to slowly walk back to Columbus and make a brew. I'm going to walk right to the end of here and there's some more on the other side but yeah it's like a van life with her log burner and everything what do you think up to now? I'll show you more round after and then uh, we'll have another there's another part to it as well so Happy days! The sun's out, no rain. What more do you want? It's a bit of a wind up, but never mind. There's Franny with you with her having a walk with me. That's a nice one, that's it, isn't it? Yeah. I don't think you can park on the left hand side, I don't know, I've read something about it, they can't do anything on the right hand side. Now we've come to the end of it now, we're just going to walk a bit further down. Some more parks up on Parry Lane going north that way. And there's a camper van there, the Cato. Top of this road here, you can see some parts up here. This is the other side to it. Like you say, I live in my van, and a lot of these here, they all live in the caravans and the vans. So I'm going to take a walk back to Columbus now, along Parry Lane, and we'll see what we're going to sort out today. Right, I'm on Parry Lane now. This is Worm Park down at the bottom. Franny's Park's up and Ray is. I don't think Ray's staying here, so no idea yet. So I'm going to get back and sort things out now and see what's happening. So come on. Don't forget to subscribe to me on YouTube. Destination Unknown Van Life. That's me, Craig. I hope you like my vlog from Cheddar Gorge. Showing you around the gorge, showing you up Jacob's Ladder. Obviously, they're all van lifers. Living the vans, nothing wrong with that.
Volkswagen LT, fully off grid, good solars on it, log burner, bang on that. Seven and a half tonner, like a container unit, but they've converted it. That looks great, good, doesn't it? On a flatbed. Now look at this. Leyland Daff, eh? Fully converted. What a machine that is, eh? To live in. Looks excellent, that. Bang on. It's home from home, that. Excellent. If I, if I see him after in the, the truck, the horse box conversion, I'll have a talk to him, see what he says and see if he can tell me more about the, around here at Clifton Downs. More vans. And there's Rainey's Mercedes. Do you, do, you can do. Oh, do us a coffee, Ray, will you? Sound. Right. Oh, latte, please. Eh? There they are. Right, we're back at my van now. Van Columbus. There's Franny. In his uh, camper van. With his great dog. Fury. It goes on. Goes on this road, a long road. There's a seven tonne road. Oh no, it's a, a, a Vico. Uh, Luton conversion converted. I've seen a few of them on the road. The American Winnebago, big bus, that in it. And there you go, it goes on. I'll do a bit more filming after. Ray's gonna put a brew on. I'm going to go to his, have a brew, and take the day out from there. So see you soon. Bye-bye. Ray's not staying here now. He's going to Western. Western Supermare. So I don't know what to do. I'm parked on the main road here. There's cars going past and everything. I'm not really bothered about that. But Ray's staying for a couple of days, so I might go to Western Supermare and I might come back here on the way back up north. I don't know. <coughs> well, that's all there is here. The caravans down the lay-by. A few over in the other lay-by and on Parry Lane, where we're parked up. The parts up on here. That's it, really. So, if I stay here later, I'll film. But it's only going to be the same of what I film now. I've had a good walk round. There's million pound houses on the other side, and a few campers parked up in that, in over there in that direction. But yeah, but I've been. Showed my face, film round. I'll just decide what to do after. So I might go beside the seaside, Western Supermer. But I'll decide after and let you all know. This is the other side to Parry Lane. That's where Columbus is parked up. Another Van life for behind. Uh, yeah, Ray will park there. He's gone down to the shop. 
and this is the stood at the other side of where I'm parked up at where I filmed at. Franny's just nipped out to a supermarket. He's just rang me up and he says there's a big incident going on not far from here with fire engines and all that. I don't know what's going on, but I'm gonna go down there, meet him up. Bye. I'm on I'm gonna go to the supermarket anyway. See what's going on. I'll do a bit of filming. Catch you later. Bye bye. Well, I've drove down from Clifton Downs and I've come across this where Franny said and Ray's parked up. Fire brigade there, aerial platforms there. I do not know what's going on. There's I'm walking back with the ice creams, which is very nice of uh, Ray and Anne. Bloody oh hell, look at that. Love is in the air, Ray and Anne. That's my love for you, Craig. <laughs> <laughs> the phone call, what Franny gave us, I've just got down here and it's only the fire brigade training. But I'm going to show you something in a minute. The view from uh, around the Clifton Suspension Bridge. As you can see, we, uh, the fire brigade are just tr in training process, that's all. But I'm going to film just down in this gorge now, heading towards Clifton Suspension Bridge. There you go. Training in progress. Haven, fire and rescue. That's all it is. It's not an incident or anything, but you want to see where they're training at. That's where we're parked up. They're training down here now. I'm going to show you. So, this is a view from where the fire brigade are training. Technical rope rescue unit. They're practicing and in training for abseiling down. But look at the river. I don't know what the river's called, I'll be truthful with you. But look at the drop, look at the road down at the bottom. I'm stood on the wall on the railings. As you can see, and the river heads all the way down, it follows the road down to Clifton Suspension Bridge in the distance over there. You can see all the rocks and all the forest, <coughs> forests and woodlands. There's a Clifton Suspension Bridge there. So, it's high up. As you can see with the road and you can see the cars going down it and at the other side of it you can see the cars there as well I'm gonna get down from here I'm gonna get back to the van just sort a few things out inside Columbus I think we're gonna be heading towards the seaside what do you think, Ray? I think we're going Western Super Road, Craig. What did you think of that Clifton Downs were Caravan City? Weren't much, was it? There's a few caravans there. I don't think it were Caravan City, but it was good to see it. Yeah. And, uh, look at Clifton Suspension Bridge, Isambard Kingdom Brunel. Bloody hell. There he, you go, everybody. He built that. Historian there, Ray. Isambard Kingdom Brunel. Yeah. Clifton Suspension Bridge. Yeah. Uh, you see, it, it was a, the, the biggest expanse of suspension bridges of, of its time. Bloody hell. Yeah. So there you go. It's not worth stopping at this Clifton Downs. There's about 40, 30 to 40 fan lifers there, but not much. They're all scattered about. Ray's here with his wife, Am. So we're going to head. I might come back here on the way back to Lancashire, me and Franny, and stay the night, but... We're going to go beside the seaside, beside the sea.